Hi, so let's take this terracotta pot that we have and we're going to make it so it's a nice place for the catfish or cichlids or other fish. Um, I'm using a really, really big terracotta pot so that my 20 inch red tail catfish Yojo will have a place to call home. And so let's get started. The first thing is we need to take the bottom out of it in order to make it so it's able to be swam through. So if you set it down, you're going to need a grinder. On the smaller ones, you can use a Dremel tool. What I recommend is to set it like this. And right about here, you're just going to cut around the outside edge and score it in. Um, I recommend trying to go half of the thickness of the terracotta, not trying to cut the whole thing. And later on, we'll punch it out. On another side note, it really, really smells. Okay, so at this point, we've got it scored all the way around using our grinder. And so you want to flip it up, hold it against yourself, and then drop a weight in the bottom of it to smash it out. Here we go. Now unfortunately, sometimes they have Furbies in them, so you have to discard the Furby. And there we have it, the bottom is out. You're going to have to smooth up all of these edges. And we'll move on to the next step. Place it over the edge of the table. And now take your grinder as you did before and cut down through the edges. I recommend about a little under a quarter of the side of the pot and that'll make a nice base for it. So now that we've gone through and we've scored both of those sides, as you can see, now we go back in with our large metal object and just tap the inside semi-roughly. And you should see a crack develop on the inside. Alright. And then tap down the other side. Eventually you'll feel it kind of shift and at that point you should just be able to give the center a halfway decent twack. From here you'll need to go across and grind down these edges. But there you have it, your terracotta pot tunnel.